15 wins in a row. How does it feel as a team? Feels good, but we always got to take it one, one game at a time. We got another game tomorrow, like Coach says, take 15 minutes, evaluate what we did well, what we didn't do well, and then come out tomorrow with a better mindset and hopefully fix and just grow a little bit more. Seemed like you guys had a concerted effort in that first half to get the ball in the paint quickly, um, and it worked out for you. Was that something that you talked about beforehand? Yeah, they do a lot of switching, and we figured out they were switching onto a guard in our post, so we had a big advantage inside. So we were really trying to get it into the post players because we know they can score, and we're really confident in them. So that was kind of the emphasis on offense. You guys struggled a little bit in the first half on three-point attempts, but is that one of those things where – you just keep getting the ball to open spots and keep trying? Yeah, I think we were a little bit in our head that first half. We didn't really come out and play how we've been playing all season. Um, and in the halftime, we just kind of remind each other, hey, we got to come together, stay positive, we got this. And I think the second half, we just got out of our heads and we're confident in ourselves and each other. I know you guys put a big emphasis on defense. That much is obvious. You had six steals today. What led to that? Um, it's just communication on defense. We all work as a unit. So it's not just one person. It takes everybody. And I really think we communicate really well to really good on their team. And I think in that second half, we did a better job at communicating where she was and we're able to just help each other out in that way. I can think of a couple of potential turning points in the second half that really got you that lead that you needed. Ellie McKay was obviously excellent. You were excellent. Do you know what the turning point was? Or I what think it one? really, yeah, I think it was really just halftime when we talked about how we need to come out, and we came, we came out strong. And it was really the stops on defense. I know we got some turnovers. We got them to miss some shots, and that led to our offense. It always comes back to our defense. So I think really it's just always our defense. Okay. You have another game, as you mentioned, again against the same team. How difficult is it to play the same team on back-to-back -back nights? Yeah, it's definitely different. I mean, first year we've ever done it, and we're right into the season, so we're getting a little bit more used to it. But we know Parkside's going to come out with everything they got. They're playing the number not, our number 10 team in the nation. So they're going to come out with everything they have, and we're going to come out even harder. Yeah, so I've always said your defense leads to your offense. Uh, so you come out of the halftime, like you said, two steals and three three-pointers. Is there What's the connection with you there? I think it just leads to more confidence, like you said. Like, um, it's just easier once you get that steal to come down and feel more confident that you can score, and then your teammates are more confident in you. And I think we just really play well together when we get those steals. We can look for each other, and it's just playing together as a team. So talk a little bit about tomorrow. It's going to be your last game as a regular season game ever. Yeah. it's. It's, it's hard. I mean, we're just really thankful that we got to play this year. With all, everything happened, we're thankful for everyone who made it happen. Um, even my family got to be here, Bailey's family's here. So it's just really cool that everyone came. And it's going to be hard. It's going to be difficult. But we love playing in that gym. We're going to take every second and every possession in, everything. And we're just going to appreciate it. And we still got more season to go. So. All right. Thank you.